Hello everybody, it's Hugo here from GameStream UK and I'm bringing you a, another tutorial much like my first one. In fact, I have covered what I'm going to do in this tutorial in my previous tutorial but I have decided to do this because a lot of my future tutorials, because I'm going to make a lot more, use Hamachi. This is a tutorial on how to set up Hamachi um, quite in depth. So the, I'm just doing it as its own tutorial rather than so I can send, once I create a new tutorial, I can send people to this tutorial so they can see this rather than me having to cover Hamachi in every single tutorial. It just makes it much, much easier for myself. Okay, so the first thing you want to do is set up Hamachi. There's going to be three sections to this video. The setup, which is going to be for everybody, how to create a server, and then how to join a server. And then which one replies applies to depending on who you are, whether you're going to be hosting the server or whether you're going to be joining somebody else's. Okay, so the first thing you want to do is download Hamachi. This is the website. I'm going to put a link in the description just to make it easier. But if you want to type it in, you can pause the video. That's the URL up there. Okay, so you can choose unmanaged or managed. I choose the unmanaged version because it's free. The managed version I think you have to pay for. You can create more, you can have more people in your server. The unmanaged means you can only have five people. I think that's fine for me at least, but if you want more, then you're going to have to get the managed version. So if you want the unmanaged version, you just tick conditions of use and then click download now. Then you just want to install it in wherever you want to install it, just the default folder, and um, then open it up. When you open it up, it will first look like this. Up here at the top is an address, I'm not going to show mine because it's it's private, um, but you, you'll be, it won't be blacked out for you, you'll be able to see it fine. Okay, so the first thing you want to do is hit this big power button here to power it on, and it'll go through all of its stuff, and uh, I'll probably just cut the video until it's done. Okay, so now it's done, you probably noticed my background has changed, I've just got my backgrounds to change, it's not uh, like a different day or anything. Okay, so now it's loaded up. These You won't have any of these because these are all servers that I've created so just ig ignore those. You'll just have a completely blank space. Okay so that is that is it on setting up Hamachi. Now you've set it up now I shall show you how to create a server and how to join somebody else's. Okay so now to create a server you want to go network create new network sorry a network not server and then you want to give it an ID, a password. So this can be anything. I'm just going to make mine um, tutorial underscore one. Now these can be taken, so you might have to rename it a couple of times. And I'm going to give the password um, tutorial. Okay, so once you've done that, you click create. It might be taken. Oh. Sorry about that, I didn't even do the do the password twice. Tutorial. So then create. Oh, and the name has been taken. I need to, as you can see, you need to find a name. I'm just going to name it something random, like, you know, no, tutorial 98. There you go, that worked. So now you have a tutorial. Now a really good idea is to take something like a notepad or, uh, oh, or something else and um, write down the details. So, um, ID tutorial oh, underscore 98 and then password tutorial okay so now you then you can just put that in the corner of your computer somewhere else where you're not going to need it and um, that's how you set up a Hamachi server this little green light will mean it's active you see mine are inactive if so I was to activate the one I use with the rest of the game stream people then now that's active and now it's an actual working server but I'm just keeping it deactivated I tend to only have one on at a time you can have as many on I'm not sure it makes a big difference okay so now on to how to join someone else's server okay so now to join somebody else's server you need to go to network join an existing network and then you have to ask the host what the ID and password is as you can see I have the ID and password here so you just type in uh, have them just send it to you over over Skype or something like that so I'm just gonna copy and paste just to make my life easier but because I'm the host I won't be able to join it but you just type it in and then you click join and then you should appear 
under here you see how it's dropped down if I go to to this one and drop that down you see I have all the people here except for myself because I'm hosting that will more people will be added there and if I go to one where it's not mine it's somebody else's his this is uh, in fact Fraser's if I go into Fraser's drop it down you won't see your own name you'll only see everybody else's who's in it but as long as it's popped up here in the window for you then it should be absolutely fine it means you've, you're in the server okay so that is the basics on how to create a Hamachi server in the future when I do other server tutorials like Minecraft or Trouble in Terrorist Town maybe or some other games um, I shall show you how to take the IP from Hamachi and use it to connect to somebody else's server I won't do that now but I'll do that in each tutorial that you need to use it in okay so thank you for watching um, any tutorial ideas please post it in the comments and I'll see you next time